weight loss Wednesday and I'm on week I'm going into week four and of course I weighed Sunday and I always Wednesday I'm uh, looking a little different cuz man I know I don't ever show like a whole body shot of me but my arms are getting better anyway I did lose I lost and I got down to 187.8 BAM so let's see that puts me at 7.7 points lost let's see can you see it chaos is erupting so that's where I'm at um I did record I do weigh myself every day I did say that I don't count I didn't I don't count every day but I did want to share this with somebody who um, was discussing like, man, you know, I get so discouraged because I'm up and down every day. Up and down every day is so normal. So I just want to show you like, I weighed on Tuesday, 188. I want to, I weighed on Friday, 187. Saturday 186.3 so you would think like Sunday's gonna be ba bam and then Sunday was 187.8 so like I totally like I'm only two tenths down from Tuesday which could totally get you discouraged in the whole yards but that's just normal that's why you pick one day this one hour every week that that's when you're gonna wait because you just fluctuate and you're measuring the difference there. And the point is you're going down. Down, down, down. So that's not a big deal. And even today, um, or this week so far, I've weighed and I'm just dropping. Like, I'm, um, I'm almost half a pound less than I was yesterday. And I was half a pound, you know. and But I don't really count any of that as a loss until the following Sunday. It just kind of gives me, like, yeah, I'm doing good. I'm going to power up. I'm going to do better. And so forth. I laid out this week differently. So, you know, I'm using my happy planner. So that's how I laid it out last week. But I've been using these little boxes to try and put, like, my balance in. And I can't get the right color gray to make it work right for stamping. So I did it different this week. I did a lot different. I really think I'm liking it. I use the narrow washi tape to um, make a place for the balance and I still did my little dotted lines. Now this down, really, do you guys have to be that loud while I'm videoing? Sorry. So I used this and I pulled this off of a form that's on my Pinterest board and then where the month goes for review I put the weekly points. So. I didn't make anything on that. I was starting to make something and it just got too complicated and I'm just not there yet. What I did was I took the weight loss log that I was using that you can find on the Pinterest and I'll go ahead and link my Pinterest there. And all I did was I cut one of these out and then I cut seven of these out and glued them in. Using my Zyron. So see how it goes. Hold on. So you can see how I did them around and then I still use the one stamp right here. And then the other thing I'm trying to do and I want to find is kind of different size stars because I want to be like, you lost a pound, you lost five pounds, you lost ten pounds, I don't know, something like that. But these are like really old stickers, probably ten year old stickers and they don't really come off really well. So I've been trying to figure that out. Um, I did, oh, and I gave myself, um, see here, I wrote that at the bottom. I'm like, keep going, you can do it, this is all ready. Happy, 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 look how good you've done, it's a new week. So, I did kind of pet myself out there, and I did, because we're in September, and I am, um, you know, create healthy habits, not um, restrictions and that's what I'm working on doing and then I haven't even begun my summary for the week so using this I have some new favorites and I will tell you I'm I started working out and I started working out yesterday and I'm doing something that for a long time I've toyed around with and I've never done 
um, much with. I would review it on YouTube and whatever. Well, they had a sale in August. I think they're having another sale in um, September. Like, there's a certain day, Tuesday in, of the month, they just slashed their prices in half. T-Taps! Okay, so here it is. Here she is. This is Teresa. So, I first heard about T-Taps from the large family logistics book you know it's an awesome book I should probably sh do a review on that but um I don't know it's just like a bunch of like posture and you do these like little movements and it doesn't look like much well I did it yesterday my legs were shaking 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 and I mean I'm talking like my core oh my goodness so I only did it's 15 minutes and it's like the basic because there's the basic plus and the basic I only did the basic and I can't do the basic plus yet I'm far from it so I did it and it's amazing by the end of the day I mean I have a hard time because you know I got the where my abs split I can't even ever say the name it's like the testic right I don't know recti whatever where they split so the idea and I'm constantly trying to remember pull your abs and if I pull my abs and I'll get it together Man, after the workout, I could just, like, it was so muscle memory to pull my abs in. Pull my abs in. I, I couldn't believe it. So, I got to do my measurements to see how things change. But I will say things are looking good in the mirror. So, three, three cool things I've found that I've added to, like, my daily diet consumption that I think are out of this world. Okay, it is from Aldi's. I only got one thing from Aldi's this week, so... Anyway, spicy guacamole in the little salad bar. You get, now I've already eaten one, two of these. Now, and the thing too is like the whole, I cut a really tiny tip here. And then I put it on my food. And then I put it in a sandwich bag and I put this corner in a corner so it doesn't all brown up. But the really cool part is it's 30 grams of this. And there's like 15 servings in here. I mean, I eat it on everything. I love, love. And the best part is you're getting your omega fats through this. I mean, it doesn't really come out and say it. But you are getting because it's guacamole. Guac, guac, guacamole. Anyway, guacamole, yeah. So, um, it comes up. It's 60 calories, 5 grams of fat, and it's 2 grams of fiber. One point. So, I love this. And you get 30 grams, which is a good amount. It's almost like two tablespoons. It is two tablespoons. Awesome. So, I eat it. I mean, I put it on my sandwich and my wraps, on my taco salads, on my salads. I mean, I love this. Okay. Then I went to Sam's. And I found these. You get two in a pack. So they're called Olay's Extreme Wellness High Fiber Low Carb. I'm not going to lie. In my book, I consider this free. Free! I know I shouldn't. I Actually, whatever I eat, I just count as a half a point. Because it has 90 calories per tortilla. Zero fat. Nine grams of fiber. Them nine grams of fiber cancels out the 90 calories. It's free in my book. But I still count it as half point. They are good and they're soft and you get like two packs. So you get 16 of them. I don't remember how much they were. But they were in Sam's. And I'm like, what? Totally awesome. Love, love, love. In fact, like the other day, yesterday I took a Smart Ones and they got like the whole enchilada fajita. I don't know what they call it now. I know it was like Spanish rice and beans 10 years ago. It's the same thing. It's just a different package they put it in. But it's where it's beans, rice, cheese, um, zucchini, and all the different things all mixed together with cheese on top. And then you microwave it. Well, I took that. Took half of it, put it in one. Took the other half, put it in the other. It's a little guacamole. And then I used some lettuce. And it was awesome. It was great. I mean, it was like I had the crunch factor, the lettuce. It was just off the charts so good and I never had eaten that in 10 12 years 13 years I've never eaten it that way like they're like okay last thing Sargento has Sharaka Jacks okay so it's a two point tea snack 
two point tea snack. See, you know, just your regular, but it has Shuraka. And I mean, I love my, I'm probably saying it wrong. No, it's Shuraka. You know, it's those peppers that burn the tar out of you. I love them. So these are so good. They are so spicy. They like cheese, spice. Everything's just happy in my mouth and happy in my stomach. So love, love, love. Hold on. So anyway, there you go. There's a few cool things I found. I'm, I'm going to do like a whole review on this later. I'm just one day in. I want to do it for a week. But I'm supposed to measure because apparently you just go like in two weeks. Significance. So I'm excited about that. And um, I felt it. Ooh. Ooh. I got to do it again today. But it's supposed to also realign you. And I really feel totally out of wacky. Hence, I go to the chiropractor all the time. So I'm hoping to get that. And then I'm hoping like it'll build my pelvic floor. And I'll pull my abs in and knit them back together. So I have big hopes for it. And it's not overly the top. And it doesn't require a lot of floor space. Anyway, so still doing good, holding strong. I am so excited. I've had some of you who are joining me, like they've that you've joined me on the Weight Watchers, doing Weight Watchers, and you join me on the Weight Loss, whether whatever you're doing. And you, I mean, I got one. Hello, she lost 10 pounds in three weeks. Three weeks, sorry. Anyways, awesome job. Awesome job, Jaybird. Awesome job. And so a little call out to her. She's actually on, um, oh, I can't think of your channel. It's like Rapid Something. She'll comment in the comments and she'll be like, yeah, that was me. I hope. And then you can go click on her and subscribe to her channel. I'm not sure if she's putting out videos or if she's just periscoping, but you can periscope. And remember, periscoping at 11 Eastern on Thursdays. And I'm becoming a periscoping addict. So every day at 11 is when we meet up and get together. But Thursdays are dedicated just to figuring out the ins and outs and accomplishments of weight loss. So we'll see you later. And I hope you have a great week. I know I'm feeling it. I'm so excited. My clothes are starting to get a little saggy. So that's nice. I can't wait to get into the clothes that's waiting for me under my bed. I'm so excited. I'm kind of like this is one I can wear. Ha ha. So excited about that. All right. Peace out.